What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Be sure to check out the new channel affiliate GT Racing. They sell gaming chairs and office chairs. All their information is linked down in the description below. Today I want to talk quickly about the Battle Pass and how we got a bit of information about the Battle Pass. We did get a confirmed time for this to come out in Activision's earnings, earnings call at the end of last week. They talked about that they were going to support key franchises with a stream of content, service, events, and features. They said this includes our new in-game system for Modern Warfare, which begins in December, slightly later than originally planned. I'm assuming either something went wrong or they're still working on it. Probably still working on it was what I would really guess, but maybe with all the updates and stuff they've had to do lately with the game, they may just have to kind of delay that battle pass just a bit. But we do know it's going to come in the month of December. I'm assuming more towards the first of the month than the end, I would guess. But I'm not 100% sure on that. They have not they have not given us a specific date yet. They may wait more towards the middle of the month of December. That way they know all those Christmas sales come in too. There'll be a lot of people won't be so far behind. Not really even mention how long each season is going to last with this battle pass. They did mention though that you will be able to earn uh, Call of Duty points, COD currency uh, within this battle pass. But I'm assuming to begin with, we're probably all going to have to purchase this if, unless you have COD points. You know, if you've ordered a, a larger edition of the game, I just bought the standard edition, so I did not get any COD points with the standard edition. I'm assuming, like I've talked about in past videos, it's probably going to be like Fortnite, Apex, all those style games where you can buy, you buy the first, you know, season pass during that uh, season. You know, you unlock all your content. You also will unlock COD points. And that will give you enough COD points to be able to purchase the next season pass. Or you can spend those COD points on things that I'm sure are going to be in the store like skins for characters or operators and skins for weapons. And then if you spend all your currency, of course, you're going to have to buy it with real cash again. No comment yet on how much this is going to cost. Most games are anywhere from like 10 to $12, maybe 15 for a battle pass, but most are like 10 to 12 bucks. When we get some more information on this, I'm, I'll, I'll be sure to bring you guys a video with that. But I just wanted to let you all know that we will be getting the Battle Pass in the month of December. So hopefully, like I said, it will be sooner kind of towards the beginning of the month rather than kind of towards the end. And hopefully it'll have some good content. You know, Black Ops 4 kind of contraband stream was kind of disappointing because a lot of times it was stickers and, and sprays and stuff like that. I'm hoping they do a bit more with, uh, with the Battle Pass in Modern Warfare. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Is December too long? Are you ready for this Battle Pass to come out? I know I am. I'm 155, so I'm definitely looking for something else to do. And of course, if you'd like to hit the like, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.